bowl experiences. Our experiences with balls. testicles. <laughs> Playing with testicles. So I don't think that balls are the most like attractive thing for people to like want to play with. Mm. I mean they're they're hot and puby and sweaty and they can smell quite a bit. It's not yeah. like the penis that's kind of like grand. Yeah. And... So I think also like when I first heard about ball play, I was like what? <laughs> Why? But then also because that you grow up hearing about how painful it is mm. when people get kicked in the balls or like they're sensitive, so sensitive. They don't want to be touched and uh, I mean I think it was my first, my second boyfriend that was like I really like playing with my balls. Why aren't you playing with my balls? I was like, "What? Huh?" You can do that? It's like a whole nother level. It's almost like playing with boobs. Yeah, but not really. Not they really. don't hurt. Well, they do hurt if you bash them. Yeah, and if you but maybe not as much as... And if you're on a hurt. period, they can hurt. Yeah, but people have said that ball pain is almost as bad as pregnancy giving birth pain. Yeah. That's quite extreme pain. To go from that extreme pain to pleasure, kind of random. It can be really pleasurable for a lot of people, which is kind of cool. So do you play with your boyfriend's balls? I do. I do. I do. Shock off. Um, <laughs> yes, he likes his balls being fondled. Fondled, that's such a good word. Because it's not like, you're not playing with them, you're fondling. Yeah. So if I'm giving him head or hand job, I will give massage. You know, yes. Uh, just move my hands around the balls as well. Like, as well as like, wank him off. Give him a little rub down there. And do you know that he likes that? Has he asked for it? I think how I found out that he liked it was the fact that he quite often grabbed them himself, like when he was mm. almost about to come or even just like randomly during a blowjob or handjob. So I was like, okay, this is the thing. Okay. Mm. Maybe he did ask me, because I feel like a lot of guys are just like, suck my balls, suck my balls. <laughs> suck <'em. laughs> But I'm not sure, mm. but maybe. Maybe he didn't ask you enough. And you do it like, is it like a normal thing? You do it every time you give him a hand job or blow job? I think probably at least a little bit every time. Mm. Yeah, like in our tips video. But what about you? Do you, with your current boyfriend, do any ball play? No, we never used to, but we're slowly bringing it in because oh. he's always had oh. extremely sensitive balls. He's never really touched them or played with them himself. Yeah. And when uh, coming from my ex, who loved ball play, like really enjoyed it, yeah. um, he was. I was really surprised that he didn't enjoy it as much as my previous partners. And it, it's only now that I've been able to start playing with his balls a bit. And he, I think that's because he's more comfortable and confident with it, and it's pleasurable for him. Yeah. Um, I wonder if it is something that guys have to really build their confidence with you before you can go putting your hands down there. Because they are, they're really delicate and sometimes they can make make him feel really squeamish. Yeah. Which isn't a sexy feeling at all. It might feel the same way that a girl feels a bit funny if her finger's going near their asshole. You know, it feels a bit like, ooh, overthinking, ooh, what are you doing? When I was doing the whole ball play hand job thing, I'd definitely be going from a blow job into a hand job and cupping the balls and like almost like Playing with them, massaging so you can feel the testicles inside, but you can't yeah. do it too hard. No. Um, and the best thing to do is ask over and over again, is this the way you like it? Because it's so different for everybody. Yeah. And it can really change. Yeah. And then with my boyfriend as of now, I have to be really careful. And also, if you're a guy watching this and someone is playing with your balls and you you just gotta say like what you're feeling because they're Please. never gonna know. Yeah, it's good to be vocal. You know, if you're yeah. enjoying it, say like that's good. Oh, I like yeah. that. Make it obvious. And if you're not enjoying it at all, say something. So if that's too hard, that's too soft. Because it can be too soft and tickly, can't it? it yeah. Can be like. <laughs> well, it's like when someone's rubbing your clit like way too much. Like even like you know, like after you orgasm and then they keep going and, and you're like, like oh, Jesus. <laughs> Same with girls out there. Say something, Jesus, always yeah, say something. Yeah. We spoke about this in our pube video, but I think personally we like balls to be shaven. Yeah, if you want your balls in our mouths, please shave them or at least clean them really fucking well because they're, they're a skin filled place. They get musty really quickly. And yeah. 
not too bad, but it's just a lot nicer without pubes. Yeah, or even even if they're just trimmed, like really short, yeah, maybe trim, like trim for the shaver. Just don't do nothing to your pubes because that's when you're going down there and you put them in your mouth and that's when you get all the hair that comes away yeah. in your mouth, down your throat. There Horrible. is a ball play etiquette. Yes, come on guys. guys. <laughs> do you want us to shave? You got a shame. So you also can use toys on balls too. Um, I know that my ex, he loved having a vibrator playing on his balls yeah. or on his shelf while I was playing with his balls. So you just got to try things out, testing yeah. some really good toys out there for that it's kind of stuff. It's so good to experiment. Like you, yeah. you find so many new pleasures mm. by just like trying different things. As well as understanding your partner or yeah. yourself. It's just, you got to give it all a go. Yeah, exactly. I think. After experimenting with things like this, you feel like a closer bond with mm. your partner as well. Like the closer you get in the bedroom, the closer you're gonna be in your relationship. Hell yeah. And the happier. Hope that's been useful for you. Um, let us know in your comments below. We'd love to hear from you. Yeah, what are your ball play experiences? <laughs> and subscribe to us. Like our video. And we'll see you next week. Next week, <laughs> bitches. Bye.